Good morning, everybody. Today is Monday, and look what we have. We received our sticker packs in the mail, and look at there's thanks to Millie. Ada's got it. She did all these awesome, wonderful designs. Look at Millie. Look at. Who is that? You're a star. So Millie is just discovering our new stickers. So if you guys haven't been watching, we opened a shop and it's called shopitsthedonnellys.com and these are one of the items that we're selling on there. It's a little sticker pack. You can stick it, snap it, wait, yep, and tag it. <laughs> there are five stickers in there. And one of them is of Miss Millie. And it says, thanks a Millie. Hey guys, put a Millie sticker on everything. Put it on your water bottle, put it on your, oh, hello. Put it on your computer. And we also received our pouches, our love that, love that Girl pouches, which I think I'm very excited about too. Oh my gosh, here we go. Ready? Love That Girl, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. That matches the shirt almost. It's a little it's bit really mintier cute. greener. It is adorable, I love the pink and green. <gasps> that is so cute, let me see inside. You put makeup in there, pencils, hair ties, hair. stickers, all your good <laughs> stuff. I just love it. Wow, Actually, that is yeah, awesome. I wish I had this for my trip last week. See, I might take it on my trip this weekend. Ha! You guys, I'm going to my high school reunion. I'm not gonna tell you how many years. We're gonna leave that. You can probably figure it out, you know how old I am. Anyway, I'm going to my high school reunion and looking to bring a little thing for my makeup. So maybe I'll put it right in there. I love it. I love it too, that's awesome. All right, so we're going to send, these are some of the um, things that we got ready to ship out some of the orders. We've got a lot more to go. So that's gonna be part of our day today. I know, there's so much to look at. She's like, ah, let me go see my ticker. Do you wanna see your portrait again? <laughs> <laughs> Bye, sweet pea, have a good day, love you, bye. All right, so remember when Millie was sitting on my sweat, my computer, I couldn't get anything done. Now she's sitting on Ada, and he was trying to fold sweatshirts. She's helping me fold. <laughs> that's very nice, by keeping you down. <laughs> Millie, what are you doing? You are so silly. Just sit right on Ada. Is she comfortable? <laughs> oh, yep. <laughs> All right, now Ada's giving Millie a piggyback ride, and she's just sitting. Oh my god! She, it. she right. does love it. <laughs> Millie, you are so silly. Ada, and you are a good, a good egg, I tell you. Hi. 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 Aiden and I came to the post office to Apparently mail. It's a holiday. It's holiday. It's Columbus Day here in the U.S. So it's closed. Darn it. So we tried to send our first order of merchandise and we were so excited it was going to be a week, week early and now we can't. I you know. It'll we're go still out tomorrow, living happy. Though. We're still we are. We're living happy. It's yes. going to go out tomorrow. It's going to go out tomorrow. And you guys will get it ASAP. You won't know the difference. Right. I think. I'm sure you're going to wait with bated breath to see us mail our first orders tomorrow. <laughs> But we'll be doing it. Adios. <laughs> Practice like champions. There they go. Love that girl. Right, guy. Your room looks clean. Is nice. this that homework? Your homework? Yes. Put that away. That's good. But it looks much better than it was earlier. So, right, guy, and I, we've been doing a little research, huh? Ryan and I thought that maybe we would start to do, well, continue, I would say, our research on what we could find about Kitty and to see if there's any other cure. Why did I say, oh, because you know why? Because you guys commented, you saw our video today about when we announced about Millie Bobilly. And when I announced her um, that she had been diagnosed, my head was a little bit fuzzy and I didn't know what it was. And it's FIP. And some of you picked that up and were able to comment in there. And you commented about Stacy Vlogs that Stacey Vlogs had a kitty with FIP and that she got cured. And so Ryan and I watched a lot of her vlogs. Stacey, you're doing a great job and we're so happy for Pip. It looks as though, however, it was a misdiagnosis. There was nothing that, I mean, if Pip had FIP and got cured naturally, that's one thing, but there wasn't any like medication or homeopathic or anything that Stacey gave to Pip. Pip was her little kitty, if you guys were not didn't see that. But anyway, Ryan and I were encouraged, so we watched that, and then we started to do some more research on maybe just other things that people have done with their kitties, and we're hoping that maybe Millie was misdiagnosed. She has a lot of the symptoms. But I'm just so conflicted about what to do. 
I did research this morning and I found that there are some researchers at Kansas State University and Cal, Cal State Davis, Cal, Cal Davis? UC Davis, UC Davis in California that have come up with something or other that helps kitties with FIP, potentially a cure. So I emailed those doctors and the they the first one emailed me back and said that um, that they're not doing any trials anymore because I wanted to see if maybe Millie could get in a trial and, and try the um, medicine. But they're not doing any trials anymore. Now it's been... Anyway, so I would like it to be able to help Millie if it's something that could. So um, I did a little research. I think I'm going to call the vet tomorrow and ask about vitamin C. I'm a little concerned because she gave us, when I left the vet the first day on Saturday, she had given Millie an injection of, um, of a pain killer, which was good. And she also gave her an injection of a steroid, which is supposed to reduce the swelling in her little body. And she responded really well to that. And then she didn't take one yesterday, of course, just the painkiller, because I had that. So I have the I have the doses, uh, the daily doses of the painkiller, but I, they did not give me the steroid. But when when I talked to the vet today, I said, oh yeah, when I came home, she did this, and she said, oh well, maybe the steroid's good for her then, if you want me to diagnose a steroid. So now I'm giving her the steroid, but now I'm reading that steroid is toxic, and we really should keep her healthy, um, keep her whole, like with whole foods and whole holistic. So I am so conflicted. I don't know what to do. I don't know if we should stop the steroid and try to give her like vitamin C and other stuff or or do both. I don't know. They did say a stress-free environment is good, which she totally is stress-free here. She loves it here. She gets tons of love. And I even Googled like vet specialists in FIP and I couldn't find any. Uh, Stacy Vlogs went to one in Utah. Maybe I know a vet. He and Just you. Just kidding, there's no way. I'm gonna say people. Yeah, it would be hard to open up a little kitty. People. Okay. Kids, in fact. Yes. Pe pediatric surgeon. Pediatric surgeon for Kate. I'm gonna be saving all the kids. If you guys have kids when you're older and you need me to save them, you're gonna do it? Pretty. Yeah, I might need to bring up my geometry grade. <laughs> yes, I think you might. This. And you shower, your tech so. egg. Well, go shower and think about geometry. Oh, am I Thank supposed you. to get a triangle on their stomach or a square? <laughs> no, I will never forget. <laughs> and I can never remember the formula for a square. Mm -hmm. So, any of you guys, thank you so much for coming along with us on our journey with Millie. I am, um, I've, <laughs> I'm devastated, I have to say. And, um, I've been doing a lot of introspective introspection and crying and I know we've only had her for three and a half weeks I mean really but still she's become such a part of our family and I love that little, little kitty what did you look for um yeah the bigger camera it makes me sad that she's such a little baby doll she also gets a an appetite stimulant I put it in her little ear which is supposed to make her want to eat more and when she eats more, she has more energy, of course, which is a good thing. Anyway, so that's my little Millie. I'm supposed to go away this weekend. I already told you that. So I'm not sure what to do about that. We have a neighbor who was a vet tech in, in her younger years, so maybe she can try to give Millie her medicine. You guys, can one of you learn how to give Millie medicine so when I go away this weekend? Got it. Katie, you want to be a surgeon for Pete's sake. Or humans. I'm not trying to shove a pill down a cat's throat. It's easy. I'll show you how to do it. It would really help me a lot. Otherwise, I have to call Miss Laura. Seriously? Kids. Katie. All right, you guys. We're going to go find Millie. See you later. Bye. Hi, Brandon Bobenin. Me, Mimo Fennin, doing your homework. I don't know how to do pre-couch. Oh, are you looking up Khan Academy? No. Well, you should. Or go there for your, during, um, study hall. To learn how to do it. You're welcome, sweet pea. Love you. And this one. She is a purring. Are you purring? She loves. Hi, lovers. Oh my gosh. Seriously, you guys. Yo, guys. So, if you guys order merch, which I know is totally off topic for Millie, it will be one of those. We have all the sweatshirts all the wristbands, all the shirts, and the baseball hats are 
And in there, oh no, it's just more shirts. The baseball hats are somewhere else. But um, just saying, it's, it's gonna be right there. Oh, also there's some more uh, sweatshirts. Um, but yeah, just saying, no, they're coming right from our basement. And I'm gonna package them, pretty cool. Um, so yeah, but back to Millie. Hi. How can the worst things happen to the cutest things? What's up, yes? It's B. What made me happy today was... Yeah, getting my homework turned in. Boom. Sorry it's blurry. But peace. You're right guy. All right, you're it. What's you're up? the you're the last one standing. Yep. Yes. And you know what? Last night or this morning, mm -hmm. I still had to drive you to school or to the bus stop. Mm -hmm. So tomorrow morning you need to wake up, okay? Mm -hmm. And you're the last well, man. Well, Dad needs to wake me up. Yeah. So if Dad wakes me up at eight fifteen, that's his fault. <laughs> To wake me up though, that's actually his job though. It is? Like, Have you I, asked him nicely to do it? Yes. And what time did you ask him to wake you up? Eight. Alright, I'll make sure you're up tomorrow night. Okay. Eight. Sharp. Eight on the dot. But this is the thing, when we come in to wake you up at eight, will you actually get out of bed? Sometimes I have to say, Ryan, put your feet on the floor. <laughs> because otherwise and you're then, like, I'm awake and you're still laying in bed. Um... One time he said, Ryan, I'm the, uh, um, you were like sitting right there and you go, Ryan, I'm going to stay here until you put your feet on the floor. <laughs> and then I go, like this. Yeah, and he's and laying he in go, bed. And then you go, both feet, and I'm like. <laughs> that is so cheaty. <laughs> both feet on the floor. <laughs> what else are you asking for? Mm -hmm. All right, let's go to bed. What made you happy today, my guy? Um. Yeah. She's a great cat. She is a great cat. And um, having a good day at school. And I went on Charlie's boat today and it was pretty fun. Okay. All right, good night, streams. I love you. I just love you too. See you in the morning. I'm going to you guys every See you tomorrow. All right. I'll see you tomorrow morning at 8. Okay. Well. Sharp. Hi, sweet girl. Of all the comfortable places in this house to rest, why are you resting here? We've got fluffy blankies, and we have humans, and we have high perches. We have little nooks, but here you are, laying next to Dad's filing cabinet. What made you happy today, Princess Winsess? She's like, Mom, leave me alone. You made me happy today, sweet bee. I love you very much. What made me happy today was having another day with my baby girl, Millie. So, comment below what made you guys happy today, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.